Hey guys, Pete here with GIS Solutions. Today I'm going to show you how to use the count points in Polygon tool in QGIS. Not only does this tool count the points within your polygon, but also adds it to your attribute table. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so let's get started. So the layers I have here are the county boundaries in the state of New Jersey, as well as hospital points in the state of New Jersey. So what I want to do is figure out how many hospitals are in each county or how many points are in each polygon here. And there's a couple ways to do it. Uh, one is to do like a select by location. Um, you can literally select the points and count them. But the count points by polygon tool will actually count them and add them to your attribute table. So under vector, we're going to come over here to analysis tools and then count points in polygon. So once we click onto that, this window will pop up. So the polygons I have, or it's just the one, it's going to be my county boundaries. My point layer, I just have one, which is the hospitals. Now you could do a weight field, a class field. As you can see, these are optional. I'm just going to leave this blank. The count field name. Now this is where it's going to, now this field is going to be added to your polygon feature here. So I'm just going to rename this to be number of hospitals. Okay. Now what we could do is either create a temporary layer and then we could click run or we could click over here and leave this file to a particular location. But for this case, I'm just going to do a temporary file. So if I click on run and the process shouldn't take too long. So if I close out of that, you see here's my temporary file called count. And this little icon means it's a temporary folder. So if I open up the attribute table by right clicking and open attribute table, and I scroll all the way over to the right, you see I have this new field called number of hospitals. And here are the totals. And what we could do is just spot count, spot check those, I should say. Like if I highlight this county here, it says there are two. Let's go ahead and zoom to it. And sure enough, looks like there's two right there. Uh, let's do one I could count easily. Maybe here, looks like there's probably three. Uh, if I just reopen the attribute table. And I select that and I scroll all the way over. Yeah, there's three. So it's just a quick and easy way to, again, count your points on top of polygons and actually add the number to your attribute field opposed to just getting a, a one-off number. Um, so if you guys have any questions about that, please, by all means, leave a comment down below. And if you're new to the channel, welcome. Um, I put out a video about once a week, so definitely hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out. And if you hit that like button, that definitely helps me greatly. As always, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.